all this sunshine that we've been experiencing today across Central Texas and the Brazos Valley, it's all coming back for tomorrow, which is great news for Valentine's Day. It's really just not going to be a better forecast uh, for the holiday. High temperatures near 70 for Central Texas, maybe around 67 for the Brazos Valley, but still looking really good there. In fact, Tuesday, also quiet, warm, no issues there. We do have our next bump in the road coming by late on Wednesday into early Thursday morning with some thunderstorms possible. And yes, there could be maybe some strong storms in that mix as well. I'll touch on that in just a moment. But again, not a very eventful future track, which is good news for us. No cloud cover out there this evening. It's going to stay very clear tonight all the way into tomorrow. This is Monday at 3 o'clock, and it's still a completely blank screen. Nothing going on here. We'll have to go all the way into Tuesday to find some cloud cover returning, maybe for the eastern half of our viewing area first and then perhaps spilling over to west of I-35. And yes, you are seeing some dots of green here on future track, but that's overdoing it. We're not going to be seeing any showers on Tuesday. Uh, that'll have to wait until late Wednesday night. Maybe as early as Wednesday afternoon, we could see a few showers perking up. But again, Wednesday night into early Thursday morning, the uh, Storm Prediction Center is basically looking at this highlighted area as their area of interest for some strong storms, maybe even a couple of severe thunderstorms to occur. And if that were to happen, it'd be primarily taking the form of damaging winds. So a lot can shape out here, and this zone will get narrowed down as we uh, go towards the actual day. But again, something to watch, just something to keep on the back burner there for the time being. 70 degree weather for the next three days. It's going to feel wonderful. So 72 on Wednesday, that 40% chance of thunderstorms could also lap over into Thursday. So I have that 40% there as well. But once that front hits, we're going to see temperatures falling through the day, leaving us with 50 degrees on Friday. At least we'll see some sunshine for the weekend and then getting back to some warmer weather about a week from now.